Hello, my hearties, dinky doo. It's just me, Scotty Wicklew, saying welcome, welcome. Sunday night, nothing gets past me. Lovely to have you with us, and I hope all is well with you. A good dinky doo to you, I say. Do come and join me because we have so much to talk about. And to do it in, so make sure that you've set your notifications so that you can get Scotty McClue any time you want. Say, I shall watch Scotty McClue sing Dinky Doo to every single one of you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Always lovely to have you with us. There's Giuseppe Bachetti, Lisa Trainer, Jim Stephen Gibb, and Malcolm Wilson. So all of you could come on and have a bit of a shout out with me, Scotty McClue. And we are, of course, live. Dinky Doo, I say, nine o'clock. And um, a very, very warm welcome. Thank you very much, of course. There's the wonderful Gordon Roddick. There's Carmick McCusker, Mark Gippert. Uh, is it Gippert or Gippert, Mark? I'm never sure. Heather Moore's watching. Dinky do, Heather. Come on, come on, come on for a chit chat. Gary Crossan. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I say lovely to have you on here as well. And tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. No Nation Radio again tonight. That seems to be that for the foreseeable future. So there we are. Love songs are the order of the day there. So we'll press on here for now. Uh, Davy Hunter Young and um, Gary, hello. Nice to see you. Thanks, Gary. Always lovely to see you as well. And Dinky Doo from me, Scotty McClure. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Are we tuned for the squeeze box? Is Jim Stephen Gibb? Yes. We'll perhaps have that tonight, Jim. Not a problem. What a week I've had. I've had such a chist. Remember, I was getting a bit of a chist last week. Well, whoa, did it flare up, I'll tell you. Richie Hanna, Dinky Doo, El Salvador, Stallione Savior, Scotty, long time no see me hotty. Dinky Do El Salvador. Rudy, Zach, let's do this. Absolutely, we are doing it, Rudy. Angel Sneddon, Dinky Do, Richie Hanna. Uh, Mark, good evening, Scotty. Hard G, Gippert. Shame about Nation Radio. Yes, I was very sorry about it because we'd have. So there we are, very, very good indeed. It's a super radio station, but they obviously want to do their music. And Scotty McClue is. Talk. So there we are. Ian Stewart. Hi, Scotty. Hope you're doing well. Uh, Scotty, you're on while I watch Trump and O'Sullivan. Lol, you like the snooker, old chum. So there we are. Wonderful stuff. Well, there's always going to be something on, so you just press on. Uh, uh, Scotty McClure presses on regardless. Good evening, Scotty. Fantastic to see you as usual. Hope you're well says the wonderful Stephen Mulgrew. Dinky do, Stephen. Great to have you with us, and welcome, welcome, welcome. I say, how's the lighting looking tonight? Is it okay? Are you getting a good go at it? So there we are. I've got lots and lots of lights, but I need to know that they're doing the stuff for you. Good evening, Scotty. Nice to see your face again, says Craig Mitchell. And yours, Craig. Uh, Stephen Allen McFadden. Dinky do, come and join us. Uh, fantastic to see you as well. So, uh, love watching you, mate. Keep up the good work, says Richie. Richie, it's an absolute privilege and a pleasure for me to pop up on Facebook Live just for a ch chat with everybody. And do spread the word. There's Billy Hunter. Dinky do, Billy. Lovely to have you with us. Jim Steele. Well, I'm delighted to J.S. Gibb, and um, I shall be giving you a wee something on the squeeze box. I'd better let everybody know that we've arrived. So what I'll do is I'll just um, be clicking away as we speak. William Cameron, uh, wonder who will win the game of billiards. So there we go. <laughs> Wonderful. Dinky do, Scotty. It's a Stephen Allen McFadgen. Dinky do, Stephen Allen McFadgen. And a warm welcome. Come on and have a shout out. Get your name in lights. Uh, courtesy of Scotty McClue. Tracy Walsh is watching. Gordon Roddick. The picture's perfect, Scotty. Thank you, Gordon. Gordon is a top television man. And he would always tell me exactly what it looks like. And I appreciate it. 
no end. So there we are, wonderful. Alex Mulgrew, dinky do, and uh, a warm wave to you as well. I can tell you, lovely to have you with us. I wish I could do back the icons. I don't think I can. All the smiley faces. Give me a load of smiley faces. Uh, hey mate, always a joy, says Richie. Shout out to Big Darren Meekin, says Chris O'Rourke. Martin Wright is watching Dinky Do. Gives a tune, Scotty. I'll be giving you a tune as the night goes on. There's no doubt about it. Uh, nice tie, Scotty. Were you bowling? <laughs> I was in bowling. Well, old Kilpatrick, actually. Chema Ad Marie, Dinky Do, El Salvador, Stalioni. Scotty, have you ever thought of being a, a darts man? That's where the money is now. 180! Wonderful stuff. No, I don't think darts are really my thing. I used to love watching Jockey Wolf. Scotty, did you steal my flat cap? No, Richie. Never stolen anything in my life. So there we are. Joyce Woods watching. Thank you, Joyce. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome. Now then, I'm just checking where we are so I can tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Get sharing and just say that we are live now. I was just about to make a cup of tea and I realized nine o'clock was flying up and I thought, oh, for goodness sake, is that you in the picture behind you? Says Chris. Yes, Chris. That's me, with old Lord Wreath the Labrador. Uh, Scottish independence is currently odds on favourite to win. How do you like them apples? Well, Rudy Zach, I tend not to talk politics at this time. I think we'll not go there just now. We'll see what happens, you know, because we've apparently been bounced into an election. You stole Angel's heart, says Davy Hunter Young. Oh, bless. Ah, what a lovely thing to say. Marianne Bryce, dinky do, Scotty. Dinky do, Marianne. Lovely to have you with us and a very, very warm welcome this Sunday evening. Now then, I'm just uh, sharing. Uh, I'm going to share in public and let everybody know that we're actually live. And that will let everybody know that we're live the new. Wonderful stuff. Um, you can all do the same. That's been shared. And I'll also share on the page. And if you can all do the same, that would be great. Um, Dinky you do, Scotty, says Marianne. Scotty, why don't you get a I'm a celebrity, get me out of here? Well, I could. How's your dog, Scotty, says Gemma and Marie McRae? He is beautiful. As you say, in his 14th year and the tail wagging. Uh, in fact, I posted a video of him. So there you are. I posted a video of him. I'll see if I can post it for you on here. Um, and let you know. There we are. We'll just keep uh, letting everybody know what's going on here, guys, uh, as we do it. Wonderful. And that can, uh, can let them get on as well. I loved uh, the Jordy Darts commentator. Such enthusiasm and patter. There's Peter Y. Dinky do, Peter. A very warm welcome to Scotty McClue's pop-up. Dinky do, I say. Gary Lee's watching. And uh, we'll see if we can get back to many, many thousands watching. I notice that two or three thousand of you come and join us, though, which is wonderful. Uh, Matthew Richard says, Dinky do, Scotty McClue. Absolutely. There's another. You've missed a capital C and a small L there, Matthew. Tech problems tonight for me. I can't watch. It's constantly freezing. Hi to everyday, Tony Mac and Davey. Have a nice evening, folks. It's Angela Sneddon. Well, I don't think it's anything. Is anybody else getting freezing? Uh, bring, okay, the snow. Says Chris. Alan Maitland. Hi, mate. How are you? I am Dinky Doo, Alan. Thank you very much for joining us. You're very, very welcome. There we are. And uh, I'm just going to share this as well, and let everybody know that we are live the new. And then we'll start sharing to the pages. Patrick Smith's watching. Come and join us, Patrick. You're very, very welcome. Dinky do. Uh, drop of the old... Uh, Ooh, that's lush. That's lovely, that is. Welcome, 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 I say. And if you can all spread the word, say, McClue is live. Get yourselves on there. I'll see if I can post the dog having a kip, because I'm sure, yes, there he is. So surely if I were to take that, 
right? See if this works, guys, and let me know. So I'll see if I can take this and uh, page it. Share to five groups, says Steve McLennan. Thank you, Marianne Bryce. Share to five groups. Um, I'm good. How's you, says John Kelly? Very good, John. Thanks very much for asking. Appreciate it. On the vodka, says Chris. Oh, no, I'm on the water. Uh, the water. You're a wee bit behind here, Scotty. The words are about five seconds behind the video or a wee bit of lip sync we'll not worry too much about that though um so yes marianne bryce has shared to five groups thanks marianne that's i'm fine too mate says alan maitland good alan pleased to hear it we'll maybe get some people on what am i doing here um uh, Save the video, change the date. Oh, I don't seem to be able to. I was hoping to copy the the link with the dog. But you'll see it if you scroll down on Scotty McLean's page. You'll see him having a wee kip there. Wonderful. Kareem Zachariah. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Scotty McLean's Sunday Night Pop-Up. Just for you, Dinky Do. Uh, get the word round, guys. Everybody share, 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 share. Uh, here we go. I don't know how much you see, you see, when I when I share it all. Um, so if I share to a page, I'll share to the Scotty McClue page, and that will get you all started on there as well with a big dinky do. Marvellous stuff. What kind of week have you had? Do tell me, I say. Uh, there we're sharing now, and I'm just going to put live now, and that will let everybody know what's happening. Hey! Does that say live now? Yes. What does that say? Still, I'll put the caps lock on. Shout at them. Live now. Lovely, lovely. That's it. Well, that's a small one. That's a small bit. If that would do. No, no, no. You don't settle for second best on here. This is Scotty McClure. Nothing but the best. Live now. And uh, there we go. Right, that's gone off there. Nilo Gorm is watching. Gemma Anne Marie McRae says, are you looking forward to Christmas? Um, yeah, you, well, we always look forward to Christmas. Hello, Scotty McClure. Hope you're well tonight. We'll be a very cold night, says Karim Zachariah. Tony Mack says, hi, Scotty. Good evening. Marvellous. Now, thank you to every single one of you for putting up with the pop-ups. We had a lady complaining, going, stop this um, recorded stuff. And I said, no, no, it's not all about you. There's other people that don't get a catch-up. It's funny. People tend to be a wee bit selfish sometimes. And if it's not suiting them, they think it's not suiting the rest of the world. Well, newsflash. That's why we have the watch parties, because it lets everybody see who hasn't managed to join us on a Sunday evening. So there you are. Dinky do, I say. Um, yes, looking forward to Christmas. Let's come on and chat politics, Scotty. El Salvador, we can't chat politics at the moment because um, we're in the for an election. Larry Don Bride. Good evening, Scotty, from a freezing Fort William. Brass Monkeys, hope you've had a great weekend, amigo. Now, Colonel McBride, do you know where... Brass Monkeys comes from. Does anybody know where Brass Monkeys comes from? Send me in your suggestions. Keep them clean. Uh, it's a fairly warm night in Manchester, says El Salvador. Ah, yes, that can all change. Well, it's apparently freezing in Fort William at the feet of the great Ben Nevis. So there we are. Wonderful stuff. Where's our American viewers? I'm wondering if this gets a bit restricted to Scottish viewers and uh, English viewers. Where's all our American and Canadian viewers who used to come on and join us all the time? We want to see a bit more of that, I say. Lots and lots of smiley faces. Thank you, my darlings. That's very lovely of you. So there we go. Um, getting everything round here. We'll share in a group as well. Very important. And, uh, oh, I can chat back to you here. I've got the device. Um, I don't have Messenger on this device because the problem I have is it cuts off the broadcast. 
So there you go. Uh, and what I'll do is I'll premiere this for you on YouTube after the program. Get everything going. Get it out there. No problem at all. And quite a good week, says Jeremy Anne Marie McCray. I am very pleased to hear it, my dear. Excellent. Just started my diet. Mrs. Mack's been strict with me. I quite like her being strict with me. But I'll better not tell her that. <laughs> ah, yes, the missy is being strict with you. Davy Hunter Young, did you do? Yes, I do, he says. Yes, you do what, Davy Hunter Young? You'll have to remind us because that's some bit back. <laughs> <coughs> Pardon me, oh my chest, my chest. If you'd seen the week I've had, oh, to, I can't begin to tell you. Well, I could, but it takes up a lot of time. We can always begin to tell you, if you know what I mean. Scotty, you're back tonight or next Friday? Um, Kareem says, oh yes, so Kareem's got messages for me. Excellent. Wonderful stuff, right. That's good, guys. I'm getting all the kind of feedback going on here. Hi, Scotty. You on the night? No, not on the night, John. Uh, we've got a problem in that I'm not on Nation Radio uh, now because they want to go all music. So I've been replaced with love songs, which is not really my thing, as you know. You know, Well, I do enjoy a wee love song, but not perhaps show, although it would probably get a huge audience, but there we are that's what happens when my clue goes on, uh, wonderful stuff so I shan't be presenting the Love Songs show, and I'm not on the Nation Radio at the moment wonderful stuff um, keep the uh, keep the messages coming so that I can see, well what have we got here uh, Brass Monkey's balls were metal balls in the gateposts and when they got cold the concrete broke and they fell off I, I think half right, Davy Hunter Young. Hi, Scotty. I'm just back home from a musical evening at the Boating Club at Riverside in Stirling. I had a nice time playing and singing folk music. Peter Dale Nevins, you would be outstanding. Were you up doing the singing yourself? I ask you. How's that lighting looking? Is it okay or is it a bit glary? I just noticed as I sat forward there, was there a change, I wonder, in the lighting? Gordon Ruddick was uh, assuring me all was well and that it's fine. Uh, so there we are. So can you all see me? And am I looking fairly bright? That's what we need to know. Um, you know, I don't actually have to be fairly bright. I just need to look fairly bright. Alistair King, the world's top engineer, is watching. Dink you do. Ooh, Alistair, the uh, funny noise at start up on one of the motors and the sort of sound of running on a bit. And when I was driving, there was a kind of click, click noise. Um, so there, this is the one that had had the new clutch. I found out there was a slightly loose bolt on the housing, on the mounting. And when that got tightened up solid, everything was absolutely tickety-woo and dinky-doo. So there we are. Have you heard of that one, Alistair? So there you go. Uh, Jenna Anne Marie McRae. Alex Robertson's watching. One of the country's top actors. Excellent Alex Robertson and Dinky Doo from Scotty McClue for this Sunday night pop-up just for you. If you've just joined us, folks, you're watching Scotty McClue. I happen to be the world's top broadcaster and the first lord of the internet. So there you are. But also the world's most humble man. And we like that. Um, Brian Muffy. So there we are. Willie Kelly, Dinky Doo. The cannonball used to contract and fall off the, uh, Gary hasn't finished it. You're absolutely right, Gary. Brass monkey weather. There was a brass plate called the monkey, and the cannonballs were piled up on it on the ship. And when the weather got very, very cold, the plate did contract, and uh, the balls could roll off the brass monkey. So that's why you could freeze the balls off of a brass monkey. Very interesting. What about that? Never a dull moment with Scotty McClure, you know. We are the knowledge show just for you, Dinky Doo. Ooh, I need your opinion. You'll perhaps see it earlier. I don't know how much everybody sees on Facebook, but you'll perhaps see 
that there's to be something like a £25 charge from some council if they have to pick up an elderly person who's fallen in their home. They charge them £25. I don't know what you think, but I was personally shocked. And it takes quite a lot to shock and disgust me, right? I don't like, now I'm not trying to be any sort of saint here, but I don't like swearing on Facebook. So there you are, I don't like it. So I tend to block the swearers, you know, from that point of view. Plus, the swearers never do themselves any good. Their credibility is completely gone as soon as they've done it. Even one or two famous people think a wee sweary word will help their case, but it doesn't. Uh, James Scott says, Dinky Doo. It's a nice night in Bournemouth, says Neil O'Gormley. Excellent. I've posted you all a nice video of the start of Scott FM. So you can have a look at that and tell me what you think. I'm wondering, I've got another device here, and I'm just wondering if I might be able to uh, do a bit more with that. I was hoping to uh, send you the dog, you see, and, uh, and let you know what was happening. So there we are. Let's see, we do a bit of sharing here. Fantastic. Wonderful. And there we are. Yes, I was hoping to send you. There's the dog now. Will it let me um, copy that link? And if I could send that up to you guys here, how would that be? Hello, do tell. There we are. Oh, hello, my office. Oh, I'll just turn myself down. Fantastic. Nice night in Bournemouth. Says Neil, we got that, Neil. Yes, absolutely. No problem at all. Right, I think I might have found this, guys. So what I'm going to do is um, I'll just refresh this. There we go. And uh, a wee bit of refreshing. Very refreshing, this, you know, broadcasting live to the world. We love it. There I am there. And um, I should be able to give you the one of the dog. So I'll pass that on to you if I can. Excellent. And uh, and I'll just share that as well. Good. You can't have too much sharing, I always say. Um, so wonderful. Bone mouths are fair old bit down. South there. Good evening, Scott. This is Alex Robertson. The Brass Monkeys. All right, DV Hunter Young. Got you. Um, oh, did you all see my answer to the Brass Monkeys? Yes, we got it, Davy. Yeah, a wee tune, says Jim Stephen. Okay, I'll get you a wee tune, Jim. Patience, patience. You need a lot of patience if you're on hospital radio. And uh, Nicky McCure, Dinky Do, Angel Snedden, Glare. You're getting glare, Angel, or are you giving me a glare? I'm never too sure, so there are a bit of glare. Man, this might be better. Is that any better? Tell me what that's like. Gordon Roddy, if you're watching, can you tell me what that looks like? Is it too dark? Uh, have you started your Xmas shopping? I've put my... Uh, <laughs> Dapper, says Angel Snedden. Thank you, Angel. Thank you, do. Um, have you started your Xmas shopping? I've put my Xmas tree up, says Kareem Zachariah. Fantastic, Kareem. We like that. <coughs> a week off there. I took a week off, you see. Marianne Bryce, thank you, too. Looking bright and dapper, Scotty. How does that look, Marianne? Because I've changed the lighting just a little bit in the last minute or so. Is it okay? Send me a thumbs up if it's okay. Jim Stephen Gibb, what are you saying? Delighted. We are delighted. Wadge is watching. Wadge Hashmi has been with us for many years. Perfect. At least it's nothing serious. No, and I didn't run it much, Alice. I don't know if there would have been a problem if I'd kept running it. Um, but I didn't run it much. Titan is lovely. You switch it off, she just stops. It was a bit like the old... Do you remember the old diesels, the Perkins? The Land Rovers had them. I used to pull um, a, a thing called the Strangler. And it shut off the diesel engine. It was a a piece of rope with a wooden toggle in the end, and you pulled it. And I assume it shut off the fuel. I mean, you'll know more than me about that, Alistair. Um, the lighting's a bit bright, Scotty, on your right side. Right, I should have changed it now, Brian Murphy. Is that any better, what you're seeing now? Does that look better? Do tell, spill the beans, because I can't see what you can see. 
you see. Uh, what's your favourite love song, Scotty? I think Barry White's always great. Absolutely, Johnny Man. I want real love songs. Listen to the Corries. Oh, the stuff's gorgeous. Listen to things like There Once Was a Troop of Irish Dragoons, The Bonny Lass of Five Eel, My Love Is Like a Red Red Rose. All these wonderful old love songs, fantastic. Did you manage to get a wee squint at McClue on the on the piano, tinkling the ivories? How are you, says Wadge? We're well, great, Wadge. Lovely to have you with us. Always good. Now, there we go. Why are you not on the radio, says Wadge? Been replaced by love songs, old boy. They want to go all music. So, um, you know, I wasn't uh, really, I'm not a great love song presenter. I might be, you never know. Uh, yes, Scotty, I've been playing guitar and singing folk music. Peter Dale Nevins, you will sound outstanding. I just know it. Um, I've been singing folk music since I was 15 years old. My brother Tommy and I were the borderers folk duo back in the late 60s and early 70s. You know, I must be septic, Peter Dale Nevins. Here's me talking about the Corries, and there you are, the borderers. Fantastic. The man himself. Welcome, welcome. I'm very, very flattered that you're taking the time to watch Scotty McClure. Fantastic. Great group. Um, I'm, I'm right about the love songs, aren't I, Peter? Come on, back me up here. Yep, says Angel Snedden. Yep, what? Is it the lighting? Is the lighting all right? There's Lynn McDowell, Dinky Doe. Lovely to have you with us. Um, are you playing a musical instrument tonight, Scotty? Says Gemma and Marie McRae. I may well do. Oh, you're back, Angel, says Davy Hunter Young. So um, disgusting, says Angel. Are you talking about the old lady that fell and they're charging? Or they're going to charge if people fall? Uh, light. Oh, yes. Excellent. Alistair King. What's Alistair saying? I saw that. I think it's disgusting, Scotty. Yes, charging the uh, old lady. I never swear in front of my ma. She's 77. She'd beat me up for it. <laughs> a lot of buffering going on the show tonight, Scotty. Is anybody else getting buffering? Brian Murphy says he's getting buffering. I think shocking about the old people. Absolutely. Should you not be getting ready for your radio show, says Scotty here? Not doing it now, Scott. Finito. So there we are. No more nation radio uh, for Scotty. Uh, for the foreseeable future. Love songs. No show tonight. Absolutely. 10 p.m. says Wadge. No, nothing happening, Wadge. 10 p.m. will finish up. Scotty, you need to start your own radio station and talk show. I think so, yes. I wonder if it's something on the satellite, something international, and we'll take phone calls. That would be a good idea, I think. Or get a wee burner phone. Lol, says Angel. That's much better, says Brian. That is much better, Scotty, says Gordon Roddick. Thanks, Gordon. Very much appreciated. Are we nice and light, though, or is it terribly dark? That's why I was wondering. A couple of weeks, it's been looking a bit dark. Uh, Chris O'Rourke. So there we are, is Nicky McHugh. Stevie Wood's watching Martin Park. Yes, says Angel Snedden. Angela Goodlett's watching. Dinky do, Angela. Give you a wave. Hi, Scotty boy, says Nicky McHugh. Hello, Nicky. Uh, Stephen Lipton's watching. John Boyle. Uh, get them told. Get on there. Well, delighted, says Stephen Give. Yes, we're delighted. Back shortly. Need to do the dishes. I'm recording it, says Davy Hunter Young. Brian Murphy, the lighting's fine now. You should keep it like that all the time. Uh, not really much for uh, Land Rover Scotty. Eh? I've seen the cut off and some old lorries too. You pulled the strangler and she just stopped. Um, John Boyle, the trumpet. Ah, uh, lighting. My pixels broken. Oh. Start your own mobile radio station, Scotty. I'll be the road crew. We'll take a big van round. That'd be good. Stephen McLaren. Uh, Trump won the snooker. If he wins Scottish and Welsh Open instant million pounds. Not bad. Tony Mack. Totally disgusting. The council charging old people £25 every time they fall. The council should hang their heads in shame. It makes you wonder where our council tax money goes. Well, it's just 
one council. It's not everyone. Hello, Scotty, how are you doing? Says Diane Marchand. It's a council down south in, uh, in England. We're talking about charging £25 to pick old people up. I mean, where's our reverence and respect, I say? That's what we're needing. Zi Kwai Tang has joined us. He's watching. Thank you. We'll give you a wave, Zi Kwai Tang. Wonderful. Now, what's happening here? There's John asking if I'm on. I sometimes wonder if people hear me. You know, I'll say to them, I'm not on the radio, and they go, why are you not on the radio tonight? Uh, then I've just told them. So there we are. Hello, Scotty, how are you doing, says Diane. Very good, Diane. Welcome. Lovely to have you with us, and dinky-do. I'm just going to do a little bit more sharing here. Uh, we did share to the Scotty McClure group. Very important. And let everybody know that we're on here live. I like that. I've put Scotty McClure live here Sunday 9 p.m. Does that suit you? Now, is this a good time for you guys? Do let me know and we'll do more of it. But uh, I want to get the figures up so you need to get sharing and sharing and sharing. It's all in the sharing uh, because I'm sure I used to look up live before I went on and it would say, you know, 4,500 people are live right now. Now it says things like five, 600 people are live. So there we are. Scotty, what do you call a dog that does magic? A labracabrador. Yeah, uh, we shout out to my son, Alistair Jr., please, Scotty. Wants to go to bed for school. Come on now, Alistair King Jr., you get off to your bobos. So you're up in plenty of time for the school in the morning. Marvellous. Scotty, what's your views on non-binary and many genders? Well, I think people can be what they want to be. The only thing is, I do look at people and I see a lady or I see a gentleman. But I don't know if it's right to say ladies and gentlemen still. I suppose you could say lady, ladies and gentlemen and um, non-gender specifics. <coughs> you must forgive me. I've had quite a chist this week, I have to say. Scott Wishon's watching. But, uh, you know, McClure, we always love of our time. Brilliant time, Scott is, as Ian Stewart. Fantastic, Ian. Lovely to have you with us. Um, let's get the sharing on the go here. There's never enough sharing, I say. And we'll share to some groups. Let them know what is what. Always good stuff. Sharing, sharing. Keep your stuff coming. I'd like some people on here with me. I'm just looking for people that have got the, the symbol. Some of you have got your own cameras there, and you could come on here. Scotty, you've got the phone set up yet. I asked you before, but I never heard what you said. No, we haven't as yet. I'm just wondering which way to go about it. We might even be as well. I don't know if we could do something on the messenger. I don't have messenger on the device we're on right now because I think it interrupts the broadcast. Uh, he thinks you're joking, Scotty. Do you want him for a week off? <laughs> Fantastic. Not joking, young Alistair. You get off to bubbles. So there we are. We'll not tell you again. Wonderful stuff. Uh, Ian Kerr's watching. Did you do? Scotty, what happens if I'm a camel and I want to identify that way? Well, Paul Mac, yes, it depends. Two humps. Um, and, uh, and and off you go. They say the camel was a horse designed by committee. There you are. The dromedary has won. Um, the whole total non-binary thing confuses me. How can someone know if they're a man or a woman? Well, there are ways of telling, Tony, trust me. Um, Davy Hunter Young, Dinky Doo, Drew Carson's watching. Nice to have you with us, Drew. And excellent stuff. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Can you all share? Very important. Can we have a bit of sharing? Do you think the show would go well live on television? Say a Friday or a Saturday night, and we'll take some calls, and maybe have an audience, a live audience. That sort of thing. Scotty McClue, just for you, saying dinky-doo. The dinky-doo show. Excellent stuff. The Scotty McClue pop-up. <laughs> I love all that stuff. Right. Um, 
It keeps freezing, says Davy Hunter Young. Ah, I wonder if it does. Does anybody else have a freezing problem? I'm not talking about the cold outside. I'm talking about the, the picture here tonight. Does anybody else get it freezing? Do tell. Is that lighter? Vice it back or that. Do tell. OMG, it actually worked as a way to bed. Cheers, Scotty. I told him three times and he refused. Yes, I know. <laughs> the wee ones. <laughs> they don't like to go, especially if they're watching Scotty McClure. So there we are. Uh, I'll send it off to our group and let them know. I wonder if we've got the Scotty McClure. Neil Holgate is watching. Wonderful stuff. Yes, it's freezing too, Scotty, says Brian Murphy. Anybody else getting the picture freezing, I ask you? I'd love to come on TV and bring out loads of ghosts. Oh, Davy Hunter Young, don't disturb them. Don't disturb the spirits. Sorry, mistype. I uh, meant to say, how can someone not know if they're a man or a woman? I don't think I could be a woman. I don't know. I mean, uh, I had a colleague who was a guy when I met him, and he's a, a, a lady now. He's a she. He is a she. She's a she. Uh, Conor McBride, an audience with Scotty McClue. Well, we did that, and I remember massive, massive sellout. Uh, Scotty, you're way better here than nation. You get stuck with way too many politics lovers on the station. Glad you're back, says Paul Mack. Uh, John Selwood, thank you, do. The wee man's a big fan. He watches the show every Sunday. Thank you, Alistair. And Dinky Do, how fantastic is that? Uh, Angel Stedden, TV, yes, TV. TV's the way ahead. I need to get the beef off me. Get the chin away. <laughs> Too fond of a wee duckin', I say. But there we go. Uh, Stephen Mooney is watching. Welcome, Stephen. And Dinky Do, and I think I probably told you this, but I met an absolute gentleman. I was out walking the dog, and it turned out he's very famous. And uh, we were having an exchange, and uh, he was telling me how much weight he'd lost. And I said that, um, you know, I, I needed to lose a wee bit of weight. Uh, you know, our, my doctor friend had told me I'll have a problem in later life. And he said, this is later life. <laughs> so <laughs> I thought that was quite fun. Uh, Steve Wilkie, thank you to come and join us. Can you imagine me on the telly? I think I'm back in Taggart. So maybe Hunter Young. Oh, Taggart's brilliant. I still love watching Taggart. I go to these channels on the telly and say, ooh, Taggart's on. Sometimes the original one, fantastic, Mark McManus. And, of course, I love the one with the wonderful Alex Norton and, uh, you know, Blythe Duff and all these superb actors. Brilliant stuff. We love it. So there are... Uh, Taggarts, I must have taggarts. I'd quite like a wee parton there, actually. I would have liked a wee parton still game, but I'm too late now, I think. I think that's, uh, that ship has sailed. Scotty, my Jack Russell identifies as a Rottweiler. Absolutely. Now, I'll tell you a new thing that came out. And what's it called? Is it un mono monosexual? I'm trying to remember. Anyway, what this actually is, is that you're in love with yourself. <coughs> Sounds quite fun, doesn't it? But no, you're actually, I mean, genuinely in love with yourself. It's not just a wee touch of the narcissism. It's actually being so in love with yourself that you could marry yourself and live with yourself forever after till death do you part or till death do you stay together. Incredible. Um, so there we are, Davy Hunter, young, wonderful. Oh, that's me. Uh, that's you, Davy Hunter, young. Yes, how fantastic. Wonderful. We love all that, all you wonderful, wonderful actors. So there we go. And um, no, I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy it. Uh, my dog identifies as my second child. Uh, it's Paul Rotten. Alistair King, you're absolutely right. You're yeah, absolutely right. And, um, <laughs> I mean, you know, <coughs> they do, actually. Um, you know, they, they just do. They're just family. Incredible. I mean, I'd like to come back, you know, reincarnate as one of my own 
Labrador dogs because they have such a good life. Fantastic. Wonderful. Now, how's things? I haven't said anything. My goodness me, I'm just thinking to myself, a lot of people are joining us here and you'll not know what's going on. You're like, who's this? Scotty McClure is my name, first lord of the internet, the world's top broadcaster, and you tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Sorry for sounding a wee bit chisty. I got uh, a chest last week. Oh! Shane, by the way, Scotty is the man I'm going to do a poem to put it in his hand. So there we are. Scotty is the man I'm going to do a poem to put in his hand. I thank you. Fantastic. What about Scotty McLean, the movie? We've still got that to go. Plus, I still think I'd make an excellent James Bond, although somebody said I'd be a very good Q. For goodness sake, 007, do grow up. Spent a lot of time on that car. Uh, Love tag out, I think. Dunderhead. So there you are. I think I actually coined the great phrase numpty heat live on Scott FM. Fancy game of snooker sometimes guest appearance at Wish Your Snooker Club would be fun. Paul Mack, I would be terrible. So there we are. These sort of things. Although... I did once thrash somebody, but I think it was purely by luck rather than judgment. And they were all telling me the rules as I was playing. But I do have a claim to fame. When I worked at Grampian Television, the ITV company in Scotland, I um, remember one Friday night and the um, controllers came on from down south to say that the snooker was going the scenic route and would their announcer top and tail it. So um, I said, uh, yes, of course I can do that. So there we are. So I got the script. I I've scribbled down what we're going to say. And uh, it was something like, um, and now as you join us at the Guildhall in Preston, Steve Davis is leading four frames to one. That sort of stuff. It's something like that. Right. Anyway, late on a Friday night, here's old McClure sitting there in the studio. When the red light went, I suddenly thought, I am live to the whole country. <laughs> the whole country. So I had to mind my P's and Q's. Every day, from the Channel Islands to John O'Groats, could hear Scotty talking. Scotty, I have to pull you up. My ex-wife bought me a video of your live show when you signed it for me and you told her I was a lucky man. By God, did you get it wrong. She wiped me out when we split. I'm so sorry to hear that, Ian. But I hope, if I may say, that you got to keep the Scotty McClure video. So there we are. But, uh, you know, I do feel for you, dear boy. Um, you know? Somebody once asked about me marrying. I said, well, look at the cost of it. It's too dear. They said, oh, you should try a divorce. So there we are. Um, it was great watching the snooker in black and white. <laughs> you still know the colours of the table. Absolutely, Davy. Uh, same here, says Davy. Yes, absolutely. Wonderful, wonderful stuff. Now, how is the time looking? Is it time I wasn't here? My goodness me, it's getting on that way. Now, I did promise you all, if you don't mind, I'll just give my, uh, I'll just sort out my wee uh, problem here. Excuse me. Uh, yeah. As I say, I sound like Nelly the Elephant, you know, with this chest, but there we are. There's a wonderful Berta King pattern watching in Port Glasgow there. Uh, are you coming back to Cumbernauld Theatre, Scotty? Well, Gemma and Marie McRae, tell me, would you all like to turn out to some big gig for one evening? Just a, a, a kind of one-off, one evening with Scotty McClure. And what format would you like that evening to take? Let's build this up. Ah, wee problem. Bet that's what your wife says. Oh, yes. Can I always squeeze in a small one? Now, uh, lots going on. Did you want to tune? Uh, Scotty McClure. So there we are. 
Where's the cue ball going? Nikki Harvey Winnings watching. Jim McDonald's watching. How wonderful. Welcome, welcome, welcome to you all, I say. You're watching Scotty McClue, the one stop broadcaster, the first lord of the internet. Johnny Garvey's watching. Hello, Johnny. And dinky do to you. A very warm welcome. Let's get shitting. Uh, oh, I need to share to the Scotty McClue group. Very, very important. Let them know what's going on. Scotty McClure and guests would still make, still game. <laughs> well, yes. I mean, what about a Scottish show? I mean, I know there's a network show done by a very big broadcaster. And, um, well, a very big, very big name. And he's got all these famous guests on. How would I be with famous Scottish guests? Because the Scots really do run the world. Let's have it straight. When do you start your new job in Parliament, Mr. Speaker? Order, order. The House will come to order. Can the right honourable gentleman please resume his seat? I won't ask him again. Could you imagine? No, no. They've got a nice, uh, a nice uh, speaker in there. I absolutely adored the last one. Uh, so wonderful. I'm a celebrity. Started tonight. Do you fancy going in that show? They could do a Glasgow version of the show in Easter House. It's a jungle out there. Now, what I've got, I've got some wonderful stuff for you. I'm a celebrity, so I'll pop that version up for you. And uh, that would be boring. Scottish famous people forget us, small people, and they're no funny. So, David, well, it depends who you get. Uh, Steve Burrows, good evening, sir. Good evening, Steve. Lovely to have you with us and welcome. Now, I'm just sharing to the Steve um, McClure fan club. Has it shared? I say, good evening, good evening to you all, and a very warm welcome. Now, I did promise you a tune, and I had another one. Uh, what have we got? Here we are here, right. Share. Uh, well, that's a watch party. We don't want that. Um, so many things. Share to your story. Oh, share to the story. I and my family would definitely be an evening with yourselves, says Ian Stewart. Absolutely. What format would you like it to take? I get told people say, you've had such an interesting life. Why not just talk about that? But is that what people want to hear? I don't know. Remember, share Scotty. Uh, it makes him more famous than it already is. Great guy. Very kind of you. Davy Hunter Young, you're a great man yourself, I say. That's, oh, that's what's going on. It's all this starter watch party, is it? Aha. Uh -huh. um, so we shared the story. So now sharing to the page. Uh, Prophet William Henry is watching. Thank you, William. Lovely to have you with us. Pay me later for us. Davy Hunter Young. Lol. Very good, Davy. Excellent stuff. We like all that. Ah. Here I go, swinging low, bye-bye blackboard, there we are, wonderful. Now, right, we've got, uh, this has come up, that it's got a technical fault, that's lovely, that is. <laughs> Attempt to reset the display, the first time you've seen, stop your computer, there we go, right, we'll put that off, oh, the lights are on that, I'll have to put it on again, wonderful. Oh, we black out there. Is everybody watching? Can you still see? Uh, be a comedian, Scotty. I think you'd go far. Well, I was a stand-up comedian until I was asked to sit down, you see, because people were laughing at me all the time. Right, there we are. We'll soon get the lights on again. When the lights go on again, all over the world tonight. And we're back in business. Excellent. Right, there we go. <coughs> Davy Hunter Young, and I see dead people also. Oh my goodness me. So they are, well, don't disturb these poor souls. To get it, poor souls. Uh, don't disturb them, I see. Oh, right. Uh, time for a tune for you lot. The wonderful stuff. Someone said I should do stand up. I said, well, I have to sit down for it. <laughs> Thank you, Tony. <laughs> Always around with a, a good wee joke there. 
We like that. Uh, what am I giving you tonight? Um... <laughs> forgive me <coughs> what a cough what a just I'm listening sounds good can we go busking down Ayrton Ayrton Centre a concert on a ball Scotties is Gemma and Marie McRae Connell McBride has got it right Jock oh he but I she lets the tears do not fall for Jocko Hazeldean. Oh, wonderful stuff. Welcome, welcome, I say. Lovely to have you with us. Now then, how's this getting on here? We just stayed, we lost the lighting and everything. A computer went doom. <laughs> Sounds like the start of a joke. I love all that. I can't see other peeps' messages, says Davy Hunter Young. If you sweep to the side, Davy, you should be able to see them there. Has anybody got the time? Because, uh, oh no, I've got to, Don't panic. Don't panic. We're all right. We'll see what's happening. Yes, we've got a few minutes left before I push off. Thank you for your company. Uh, it's just been wonderful having you. Don't know the tune, says Brian Murphy. Somebody's just got it, Brian. How amazing is that? There's a lot of very, very clever people out there, and somebody just got that tune incredible. Wonderful, wonderful. Now, I'm just trying to see if I can uh, get this going here. Ah, there we are. Wow. Fantastic. Share. We're sharing on your page, and off this goes... To Scotty McCrew, can you believe it? Fantastic. Right, there we are. It does look um, a wee bit sort of, um, I don't know, I'll show you what I've got here. See what you think. There we are. So you can see what I'm up to there, but I think that's a little bit, a little bit behind. Hey, blame Angel for me coming to bug you with the chats. Not at all. Where's my tablet, Mrs. McClure? Oh the, tab oh, the tablet. No, the tablets. <laughs> I thought you meant the tablet. <laughs> Wonderful stuff. Right, what we'll do, um, we'll get that on the go here and uh, let everybody know what's happening. Uh, I'm trying to get it shared with the group, though. So uh, how do we do that? Share with the group. Um, share to page. Uh, share to group. Good. Here we've got it. We've got it. Don't worry. Fantastic, and here we go, one, three, wonderful, there we are, all up there for them, for, that'll do them, I think, right. right, so that's fine, and it just lets them all know that it's going on right now as we speak, how amazing is that, <laughs> fantastic, wonderful, the buffering is very, very slow, so there we go. Now, I'm wondering if I've got too many devices running then. What I'll do is I'll power that one off. We don't need it now. We've done the sharing. We don't want it to be too slow. And, and we're back. And I'm glad you recognize the tune. 
Um, cracking up here, says Angel. I uh, have to make the mouse run quicker to stop the buffering. Scotty McClure, have a good week. Absolutely. Listen, guys, if we're buffering, I'll push off. It's been outstanding being with you tonight. Thank you very much for joining us. Spend the week sharing this every time you see McClure's face. Every time you get a wee look at my coupon, just click share and send it round everybody. Have a great week. Is your friend sorted now after the appeal, Scotty? Not too bad, Alistair. Very, very grateful to everybody for that. So, um, you know, I don't think the health's quite so good, but uh, the pennies, absolutely wonderful. Thank you for that. Uh, cheers, mate. Enjoyed your chats. Not at all, Lily Patterson. Thank you, do. Lovely to have had you all with us tonight. And um, if you like this, then we'll maybe catch up next Sunday as well and make it a regular thing. Can we have the goodbye song? Of course you can. Here we go. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. Of vita zain. Au revoir and cheerio. Cheerio, everybody. Thanks so much for watching. Take care of your dear selves and have a gorgeous week. Ta la la! Scotty McClure has left the building. Oh.